Byron needs to stop throwing stones in his glass house. The way he just tells absolute falsehoods with ease is disturbing. Watch this, then I'll show you a 2014 interview he did about his criminal charges. President of the United States who has the ability, the singular ability, as head of the executive branch to declassify information, and he has actually been working with the National Archives about that for a year and a half. For someone so quick to inform people of right and wrong, he certainly seems confused about it himself. People will do anything to maintain power and authority. I think it's wrong. Byron Donalds won't say who those people are, but blames them for revealing his criminal past. It's been posted on the internet after it was ordered sealed by the courts. A 1997 misdemeanor arrest for distribution of marijuana, and in 2000, a second degree felony for receiving a bribe. Donald says those claims are inaccurate. He claims he was arrested for possession of pot, not distribution, and the second offense was for theft, not taking a bribe. Uh, Fifteen years ago, um, I came in contact with a girl. Um, she offered me $1,000 for my debit card and, and my PIN number, um, and I gave it to her. I never got the $1,000, but I had to make restitution to the bank uh, in excess of $7,000.